Hey, what's going on everybody? James here. Uh, on my way right now to Rogue Fitness to pick up some bumper plates for the basement gym. I uh, got my little man in the back. You can probably hear him. He's a little agitated. Been in the car seat and all. But um, trying out something new today. Go do a product review. We're going to pick up the Color Eco bumper plates. I've read a lot of reviews about them. Most of them seem really good. And I have had some experience with some of the Rogue bumper plates. And I think these will be a great fit for my home gym. Not so much for a commercial gym as a wear and tear. But we're definitely going to take a look at these in depth and uh, see them up close. So uh, check back with me in a few minutes. And actually, no, I'll check back with you in a few minutes. So here we are at Road Fitness. About to come check out the spot, pick up these plates. Hey, what's going on everybody uh, finally we get to go ahead and open up the uh, bumper plates it's a little bit later in the evening had a lot to do today um, as far as this part of the video goes had a little bit of technical difficulties with the microphone so as you see I'm not talking to myself I was actually talking to you guys uh, but the mic seemed to have went out on us so here's a voiceover as you can see here just cutting it up uh, the packaging is really secure. Most things I get from Rogue are very secure in terms of packaging. And yes, I do need to give me a box cutter. Not sure what happened. The first one we're opening up is a 55 pounder. It is red um, as IWF standards go. It's packed in pretty tightly with some type of paper foam over top of it. But um, it looks really good otherwise. As you can see, it comes out the package really nice. It's clean, um, it's not slippery, does not have an odor like I read about online. So I don't know if they changed the formula or not. You can see the emboss of the 55 pounds. You have the rogue lettering. Pretty clean, no slickery, no slip filling, no oil, none of that other stuff that they were talking about. Not too thick of a bar, just the right amount of uh, on the plate and uh, seem to be feel pretty good. I'll weigh them later to verify they're 55 just to be able to be safe. But uh, moving on here, we'll go to the uh, 45 and uh, check that out. So we got the 45 out, uh, same packaging as the 55, uh, same feeling, no gloss, no smell. It looks really good, really clean. Uh, both plates had great edging, uh, very smooth. Um, you could tell they didn't weren't cheap on it. Um, even though these are not made in the U.S. like most world products are, this was a really good feel. Um, Really, really good quality, man. Like I said, I, I really trust a lot of things that Rogue has. So we're going to go ahead and unpackage the other uh, two plates, load them up on the uh, Ohio Rogue bar, and uh, give it a try. 
So here we go. Uh, we got all four plates on the bar. Still plenty of room um, on the collars to definitely uh, have more plates. I'm going to be adding some steel plates to it. The bounce was very minimal, also very quiet. Uh, definitely, definitely a keeper. Uh, for the price, you can't beat it. So that's about it, everybody. I'm definitely going to um, probably get a couple more of these. But right now, these are just, these are nice for a home gym. I recommend you picking them up. You can't beat them. Uh, best quality, shipping's included if you're not in the Columbus area. Uh, do you buy the packages? So as always, thanks for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe, share, and definitely comment if you'd like to see more of these videos. I will be doing a full home gym review pretty soon of other road products that I do have. So uh, keep a lookout for that. Thank you guys and uh, be blessed.